What's up everyone and welcome back to another video. It's actually been a little bit since I've uploaded. I had two videos that I put out that I was really like happy with, so I was just letting them roll. I'm going to be putting out a video every single week until Christmas. Um, even including some renovation videos, but I'm going to do an abandoned video every week and then probably for Christmas give you guys a big update on the house, what's going on and uh, everything like that. Maybe a video in between there for the cabin as well, um, but I want to be really active until Christmas and then not just end Christmas, keep going. But anyway guys, these are some videos I had stacked, some abandoned explorers, so I'm going to go ahead and just film a newer intro for it and then go ahead and put it up. But this house is awesome, it's gigantic, indoor pool, so much stuff left behind. I don't even want to bore you guys with this intro, so let's go ahead and jump into the video. Yeah, it's like Scarface style. Soon as you walk in the house, this is the staircase you see. Look at this. Dude, this view from the inside is wild. They would have just had this awesome basement just to hang out. Oh my god. What's up everyone? I'm back starting off another video right now. Before this video even starts, go ahead and follow all my social media link below. So right now I'm at another massive abandoned mansion. Soon as you walk in the house, this is the staircase you see. How stunning is this? Look how tall these ceilings are. So I just wanna go ahead and walk around the bottom floor real fast, kinda of see. What there is around here, this is just an empty room. What's over here? This looks like this would have been a kitchen. This is possibly a kitchen back in the day before it was completely ripped out. What's this? Oh, this is like an old laundry room right here. <clears throat> this looks like it would have just been a pantry, but you get the idea. This is the old kitchen, and right over there is just an extra bit of a sunroom, living room space. Guys, something that I'm just noticing right now, behind the staircase, there is another fully indoor pool, a massive swimming pool that I'm going to be getting to. Okay, so let's adventure up the grand staircase right now. Look at the pool from up here. Man, that's a deep pool. So this is clearly a little girl's bedroom. Must have been a daughter's bedroom. Pretty small. What's this right here? Ah, this is a bathroom, like a kid's bathroom. It has a shower right here. As you can see, more Barbie dolls and stuff. The sink is now off the wall, and the hot tub is a little bit destroyed. But you get the whole idea. And like This place is outdated, but probably was once really nice. This carpet is absolutely soaked, and you can see a chandelier even fell off and broke and now the carpet's got mold on it. Walking across the pool, look at this like little over, overlook of the pool you had here. Like when do you ever see a house that has something like this? Like on this little balcony of the staircase overlooks this swimming pool and then even has a staircase leading into it. But first I wanna hit all these upstairs bedrooms and see what else we can find. This is just a closet in here. Bathroom right here. Definitely a bit of an older shower. This looks like very outdated compared to the others. And this must have been, this could have been like a playroom of some sort. I'm not exactly sure. This house is laid out really odd. You can even see the pool room down there. This so far, so many of these explorers in Canada have been unbelievable. Like I can't even believe I'm getting to explore these places. So let's just keep adventuring through it. This house is like a maze. It 
Let's walk around this chandelier. Into, uh, here's the bathroom again. So this is just the other side of the bathroom. You can see the ceiling. The floors are all soaked. So last but not least, right up here, appears to be the master bedroom. Am I right? Oh my God. Yup, definitely right about that. Oh my God, check this out. It's like Scarface style bathroom. Gold with black. There's a shower, bathroom, humongous hot tub, big sink space, huge countertops. Whoa. And then what leads into a walk-in closet with a ton of space. This has a bidet as well. Oh my God, what's this? Is this a sauna? Look at this, guys. There's another sauna in this house. Or not another one, but I'm just exploring another house that has a sauna in it, rather. Look at that, right out of the bathroom, you can just hit the sauna. That cedar wood still smells great. On the outside, you can barely see in, but once you're on the inside, you can literally see out like completely normal glass. The glass is tinted. But you get the idea, this would have been the master bedroom right here. Even has the outline where the bed would have been. And that looks like the dressers are still, would have been lined up there by the indents in the carpet. This room is actually pretty long too. But the, surprisingly, the bathroom takes up like a lot of it. Like I've mentioned a hundred times, I can't even tell you how stoked I am on being able to explore a place like this. These houses are super luxurious and never ever would I have thought I would be exploring something of this caliber. Right behind the main staircase is the staircase going down to the basement. Right down here. Oh my God, look at this. This is like a dungeon down here. Look at these little cave doorways. Has like old medieval doors looking like. This is just a long, narrow room. I don't even know what this is used for. But look at this. The bar down here. Fireplace. And as you guys can even tell, this place has power. So these lights are even on by a timer. But look at this bar. You'd come down to this bar. Look at the design on it. Where do you ever see stuff like this? Old dartboard. Let's go through this little cave right here. What's this? Oh, it smells like a wine cellar. Definitely see the wine bottle racks back there? There's even one in there right now. No matter how long a place is abandoned, that stuff will always smell good. What are these? Propane tanks or something? Look at the wallpaper back here. Also, oh, you can't even see on camera. It's so cold down here, you can actually see your breath. And this is just an industrial room back here. Look at the design of this place though. Obviously a little sink would have been here and you would have just had this awesome basement just to hang out in. Let me know what you guys think. Drop a comment down below if you would like to live in a house like this or especially in your house have a basement like this because this is honestly one of the coolest things I've ever seen. It's like laid out like an old dungeon. And what would this been? I don't know what this would have been. But there's just all clear glass racks. Who knows, maybe like... Let me know what you guys think this would have been. Drop it in the comments down below right now. Didn't go back here yet. That's just underneath the stairs. Looks like another staircase back up. This whole house is laid out like a maze, I'm telling you guys. I smell more cedar. Yep, look. What's this, a little, this is like a little locker room. This is an all blue bathroom, whoa. Literally everything's blue in here. This is like awesome for a little kid. 
but I told you I smelled more cedar. This is another sauna. They have two saunas so far in this house. Look how blue it is. Toilet's blue, sink's blue, everything's blue. So real quick, I wanna just take a look up these stairs. Yeah, this is definitely the pool room up here. So, so let me just finish up the basement before I even head to the pool room, just to see everything down here. This is just another industrial room, probably for the pool. Looks like there's a pool pump back there. And then this is just under the staircase, like I mentioned before. So I actually did explore the whole basement. Look at the door handle on this door. Really odd. I figured I'd just show you guys that. All right, but we are leaving the basement officially. I think there's only one thing left to explore. I think, there actually might be a room over here I didn't hit yet, but so far, everything has been unbelievable. And uh, I think there's one room left. It's the coolest room in the house so far, and I haven't even been in it. Let's explore the indoor pool room. Well guys, this, oh my God. It even goes upstairs over there. And this is the huge lookout I was looking through. Oh my God, look how deep this is too. This place is literally on, like you can't even imagine how big this is. Cam the camera literally doesn't even do it justice. It even has its own diving board. You could actually probably even hit your head on this diving board. The ceiling isn't that tall. Also, something Carlo just pointed out, look at all the vents around this entire place. On both sides. They're all over there too. Just to keep this whole room warm. Dude, this place is absolutely, this is crazy. This is just like the Mafia Mansion. Yeah. Like this, like this pool, the indoor pool. I never hit spots with indoor pool, so this is a first, if you guys know. But here, let's finish, let's finish the walk around of this place. You can even see right here is a little staircase that goes back upstairs that I showed you. But look at this. Dude, this view from the inside is wild. You know what was pointing out to me the other day when I was What's here? That? This is a real tree because look at the leaves. Yeah, they're dead. Yeah, but I didn't it's even a, realize it's a, it's a real tree though. Yeah, how's it like, sound? How is it surviving? Oh, no. out of, it's been abandoned <laughs> I didn't so think long. of that. No one's been watering it. It and still is alive. Yeah, look at all the dead leaves on the ground <laughs> and it's still, uh, yep. still alive. Or, trying to survive. Probably that little bit of sunlight coming in up there. But wouldn't they need water to grow or no? Probably, for sure. Maybe it just gets it from the pool. <laughs> you know where that step is right there? Yeah. It used to be that high. That was probably like just over a year ago. So how does the pool drain this much? All right, so I think this is my favorite part of the house so far. Obviously the indoor pool and just this whole room right here, but I think we are heading out now. So I'm gonna film any shots I can get on the way out. All right, but goodbye to another huge abandoned mansion. Probably the coolest, if not second coolest I've ever seen. All right, everyone, I think that's gonna wrap this video up. If you guys did enjoy, please like, comment, subscribe. Like I mentioned, I'm gonna be uploading every single week, uh, hopefully mostly abandoned videos, but even cabin videos too. And for Christmas, I, like I said, I wanna do like a big cabin video. Um, maybe even upload that on Christmas day. I'm, I'm not really sure. But anyway, guys, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for the support. Follow all my social media link down below, and I'll see you in the next video. Later.